So here's how to upload your first video to your IGTV account. So you want to go ahead and click the IGTV logo. This is going to open up your account and it's going to go into your feed. So it's going to show you some of the most popular. This is a very urgent fork in the road. Maybe it's okay, so what it does is it brings you to your followers and the most popular and the top videos that are currently on IGTV. So it will just play the first one from any of those categories. What you want to do is you want to click the browse button. Now the browse button will bring up this little menu for you following popular history, but we want to concentrate on this icon here. This is your profile image that IGTV have pulled in from your Instagram account. So you want to go ahead and click that. Once you've clicked that, it will pull in some other information from your account. And also if you've already uploaded an IGTV video like I have, it will have those showing down below. But you are just about to upload your very first IGTV video to your IGTV account. Now remember the video has to be a minimum of 15 seconds and if you have less than 10,000 followers a maximum of 10 minutes. If you are lucky enough or not to have over 10,000 followers then you can have up to 60 minutes of video. So what you want to do is you want to click this plus sign. Now this plus sign will open up the videos inside your camera roll on your mobile phone. Now there are two ways to upload video to IGTV even though primarily Instagram is a phone only app IGTV does allow you to upload your videos direct from your desktop and if you watch right to the end of this video the bonus will show you that there is actually a quick video recording of how to do that from your desktop as well. So we're going to click plus on here and then we're going to choose a video that you want to upload. Now, as you can see from the selection on the screen here, the ones that are um, faded out are less than 15 seconds and therefore they're not long enough to be uploaded. So it will only show you those that are long enough to be uploaded to IGTV. So I'm gonna go ahead and select this one. Once you've selected your So what video, is IGTV and how do you set it up? It will give you a complete replay of your video. So if you want to double check that everything is in order before you go ahead and click next, then you can watch your video all the way through. If you've already watched it and you're happy with the content, then you just go ahead and click next. So this is where IGTV falls in line with YouTube. It allows you to upload your own custom thumbnail. The only difference between IGTV and thumbnails thumbnails and YouTube is that you can't change the thumbnail on your IGTV account after you've uploaded your video. So you have to be sure that the thumbnail you're going to use on your IGTV account is the one you want to use. Whereas on YouTube you can swap your thumbnails up even after you've published. Now bear in mind that IGTV is linked seamlessly to your Instagram account and when we click the next button it's going to give you the option to share a one minute preview into your Instagram feed. Because what Instagram TV wants to do is it wants to increase its profile and sit aside Instagram. And therefore, by sharing a minute of your video from your IGTV account into your Instagram feed, then you are opening up your IGTV account to a bigger audience. So it is something that I would recommend that you do share your one minute preview into your Instagram feed. But with that in mind, and if you are very, very particular about your nine square feed inside your Instagram account, then your thumbnail should fit aesthetically with the other images in your Instagram feed. Now with IGTV, that can be a little bit tricky if you use a thumbnail from the bottom selection. So you can choose one from the video itself by sliding this little slider across and then you can choose a thumbnail from here. Now if however you want to pre-make a thumbnail you could use a tool such as Canva which is a free online photo editing creator tool and then you can upload your own image into your camera roll and then upload it onto here. So to do that you create your image and I would do it in the same dimensions as Instagram TV, add from camera roll, 
and then it will ask you to select. So I'm going to select this one here, which is how to open your own Instagram TV account. So that's the video I'm uploading into my account at the moment. So if you're happy with that, then you can just click next. Now, just one thing to bear in mind, the image that's pulled over in your preview is not quite square. It is actually like a portrait version, but it's not as high as the full IGTV image. So try and keep the main bulk of your information in the center. So if you were to, to divide this into fifths, the middle three fifths is where most of your information needs to go. You also have a time up here and you also have your video title that will appear down here. So I will make sure that I put the dimensions into the description for you of this video showing you what the dimensions are inside your Canva account or any app that you can use to create your images, Photoshop and so on. So once you're happy with the thumbnail, go ahead and click next. So this is where you can add your title and your description. This is where you give IGTV authority to post a preview of up to a minute onto your account. If I click learn more, you can see that what it does is it will just show you how do I upload. So it will tell you that you can upload a preview. So we're just going to close that down. So if you want to look at that, you can click the learn more as you do your own first IGTV video. You can also make it visible on Facebook. So this will go directly to your Facebook business page. If you are using your Instagram account as a business account, you can also show your videos on to your Facebook business page as well. And to do that, you would click the button and it will ask you which Facebook business page you want to connect it to. So to start off with, your title will always show. So you want to pop your title in here. So I'm going to put how to open your own Instagram TV account, IGTV. Okay, and then you can put emojis in here if you want to, just to jazz up the title a little bit, to make it a little bit more. And then in the description, you want to explain exactly what it is that you are doing in the video and why you are offering it to your followers. So this is where you can put in here. So IGTV was introduced in 2018, but is not being used very often as a marketing tool for savvy business owners like you. Watch this how-to video and set yourself up a I Instagram oops, TV channel today. So I'm just giving them a brief overview. Now this description, not all of it goes over to Instagram and hopefully they will start doing this because what would be really cool and they don't do it at the moment is that when you do your title and your description that it should all go over to the Instagram feed. It doesn't all. Now one of the things that IGTV description does allow you to do is actually put a clickable link in. So I'm going to be uploading these videos to my YouTube channel as well, which is Anita Wong. So if you wanted to, you could go and check out my YouTube account and I would love for you to give me a follow up over there. But what you could do is use your IGTV account to pull people over to your YouTube account or to your Facebook page or to your website. So you can put the link in here. So I'm gonna put the link in here. So I'm going to put another emoji there. I'm going to put check out my YouTube account as well. Click here to go direct. And then you put in the YouTube or the link that you want it to go to account. And it will take you out and I'll show you that it will take you, but it will only take you if you click the link inside IGTV. So the link won't be clickable in Instagram, 
but it will be clickable in your IGTV account. And I'm going to show you how to, you can educate your followers to find that link. Forward slash C forward slash Anita Wong. Okay, cool. So you can add some hashtags in here for some search. So I'm going to put IGTV and then I'm going to put um, how to video. And you can just keep putting any of these hashtags in here just to help with the search inside IGTV. Instagram coach. Oops. So what we can do as well is once we've posted this into our IGTV account, the preview that shows up in your Instagram account won't have a lot of description. So it's recommended that you go over there and you add your hashtags in as a comment, just to help with the search for your video to be seen more inside there. So once you're happy with your title and your description, you click, check that you've checked post a preview, and then you click post. Now what will happen is it will upload your IGTV video into your account. So well done everyone, yay, pull the, put the fireworks out, pull the party poppers. You have just followed the how-to instructions to upload your very first IGT video. So well done you. So now as you can see my video is in. So if I click on it, it will show my So video what is IGTV and, and how do you set it up? Everything that well, you need to want to. So have an Instagram account. What I wanted to do is show you about the title and the description. So here, how to open your own Instagram TV account. So you see this very little small upside down triangle here. So this is where IGTV should make this much bigger. When you click that, you see how we've got some writing. Now, unfortunately, the way IGTV is set out, the writing doesn't really pop, but the link here is clickable. So if I was to click on that link, it actually opens up to my YouTube account. So this is something that everyone is missing about IGTV. And I don't have 10,000 followers on my IGTV account. You saw that I have about 1,700 followers on my Instagram account, and that carries over to your IGTV account. But what I do have inside my IGTV account is the ability to add a clickable link, but it is hidden here. And this is where you've got to make a big point of educating your followers that there is a clickable link in here. So that's how you can do it. So that's basically how to upload a IGTV video. So I'm gonna show you now the view inside Instagram. So we go over to Instagram and we go over to my account. And as you can see, my video is here. So what's happened is that my video on IGTV has been uploaded into my IGTV account, but there is a one minute preview inside my feed. So here we go, and it has this thing here, watch full IGTV video here. And what we can see is that we've got the title and then we've got a little bit of the description. But obviously this YouTube link is not clickable inside inside Instagram. You see it's not clickable, I'm trying to click it and it's not going anywhere. So you can add more description in now and you have got a few more hashtags. So you, they have enlarged this opportunity. But I would still go back in and add a bit more hashtags into your comments if you want to and also add a few more hashtags into your search but for the starter you can do that and it's really cool now you can edit the preview inside of your ig instagram so if you click these three little dots it gives you the option to remove remove the preview and edit the preview so you can edit the preview again but you just can't change the thumbnail so you could go in here and add some more of your hashtags if you wanted to, add a little bit more information in the description if you wanted to. I'm gonna go back in a bit later and add a rundown of what's in my video so it makes it easier for people to see what's going on. So that's how to add your IGTV video to your account via your, via your 
iPhone. So stay tuned, I'm gonna show you how to add the same video via your desktop. Okay, so as promised, here is how to upload your own videos to your IGTV account from your desktop. So what you wanna do is you want to go to your profile, and as you can see, this is my profile. Give me a follow if you like what you're seeing. And then you click here where it says IGTV. And this will open up the upload button. And this is where you can upload your own video. So you click upload. Then again, it's similar to what we just did in the iPhone. What you want to do is you want to drag your video in or you find your file. So we're going to go here. And we're going to click open. So that's going to pull my video in. I'm then going to edit my cover. So again, I want to upload my own image. So I'm going to add this one in here and we're going to click open. We are then going to add our title again. So how to open your own IGTV account. And then you can put your emojis if you know how to do it on your desktop, um, like so. You can add your description. So again, add your description. Now you can still put your clickable link in here, but obviously it's not going to be clickable on the desktop version of Instagram, but it will be clickable on your IGTV version inside your phone. And we can check out in a moment if it's clickable on the IGTV version here on the desktop. So we're going to write in our details in here. We're gonna click post a preview, and then it's gonna ask you where your video will appear. So we're gonna go IGTV. If you want, again, like I said, to add it directly to your Facebook page, you can, and then you're gonna click post. You can save a draft on your desktop, which is quite cool. So it means you can come back and add in, especially if you want to get some different hashtags, because remember, you can put everything in here that you need. So click post, and then it will upload your video to your IGTV account from your desktop the same way as it did inside your normal account. So it will come in here once it's completely uploaded. And then when we're here, again, I've just added it in, I'm gonna delete it in a minute. So when you click on the IGTV, you can see that there is a link here when you're looking at an IGTV, you can click it, it will go direct to your YouTube account from your IGTV account if you're viewing it on the desktop. So that's something that you could tell your followers to do if they're viewing your video on their desktop. Obviously IGTV and Instagram is a phone app, but you can view on a desktop. And this just shows that if you're looking at your IGTV video, videos inside your desktop, you can actually have a clickable link in your description, which is awesome because you can't do that on your phone inside Instagram, but you can do it on your desktop, so that's amazing. So that's how you can add your video to your Instagram account via IGTV from your desktop.